And a one, and a two, and a comedy journal, Jack 56, doing much more than just picking up sticks. 1630, Saturday the 10th, February 2018. As the 21-year-old Russian bobsledder begins his run, I said, Hey, look, the Russian's Russian. 1640, 10 minutes later, you know. Luke's trying to figure out how to get a stubborn nut loose. I suggested getting it mad. 2240, Saturday the 10th, February 2018. Referring to something I think somebody said. That must be his method of dealing with me, Harry says. We all have one. And I caught it a second later. 1720, Tuesday the 13th. <clears throat> I said, I'm hungry and I'm going to the grocery store. Jim said, you may f just find a solution to your problem there. My problem is going while hungry, though. Well, with your all-star ability to make decisions, it will go as well as a crash at rush hour. I don't suppose it helps that crashing during rush hour is an easy thing to accomplish. There are two sides to just about anything, so I guess it depends on your view. Your p viewpoint. Whatever view it is I have right now, it is highly hindered by hunger. Happenstantially. Just grab a potato and run. Preferably around the inside of the store, not out the front door. Unless it can be filmed and watched later. Now I'm standing in front of the cooler with a huge grin on my face. Okay, but that is not where they keep the potatoes. Whatever, good luck. I found the ice cream. Does that count? They make potato ice cream? Wow. Is it just frozen soup? It's cold. That's all I know. 2110, Wednesday the 14th. <clears throat> Ernie asks me a very serious question. My question is, So what do you do when you're not here, Kyle? I said, be somewhere else. 1735, Thursday the 15th. A girl with whom I am very closely related said, I've got frozen chicken finger hands. I didn't have any context either, so that's all you get. It's funny. Until I call it funny. 22, 20, no, 20. <clears throat> Civilian time at 8.55 p.m. 20.55. I said to Ken, I had a guy ask me today if I ever get scared doing this job. Is delivering pizza in the ghetto. Ken said, do you? I said, I told him I don't, but sometimes I do, except I never tell anybody that. You just told me. Yeah, but you're not anybody. I'm somebody. Yep, you're somebody. And from the lips of the starving comedian, how did the hipster burn his mouth? He ate the pizza before it was cool.